What's up guys, I'm Riley. Welcome to day one of Journey Youth Ignite. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to make Bible study a bigger part of your life. Number one, make Bible study a part of your daily routine. This tip is vital, I promise you, if you don't do anything else to do this. Create a morning or evening routine that's centered around Bible study. Bible studying in the morning is so rewarding because throughout the day, you know it's already done. Whenever you decide to Bible study, whether it's morning or evening, you need to stick with it. Number two, read a book and not a verse. Choose a book in the Bible that interests you and start reading. Reading one book at a time is the best way to get an understanding of what it is that you're reading. Focus on reading the entire book from beginning to end. I know it can be tempting to skip around, but think about it like this. When you read a novel, do you read chapter 1 and then skip to chapter 15? No, right? Because you'd be completely lost about what's happening in the novel. So don't worry, because you don't have to read from Genesis to Revelation. At the very least, just read it book by book. I completely understand if you want to read different reading plans for encouragement or inspiration. Because from time to time, you may need some biblical understanding for peace of mind. Just recognize that reading a Bible plan that skips from Bible book to Bible book is great for inspiration. But inspirational Bible reading doesn't always equal understanding what it is that you read in the Bible. Context is everything. Number three, take notes on what you've read. Reflecting on your Bible study is powerful. Reading without reflecting is not helpful. So be sure to take the time to reflect after you've read your Bible. Whether you use the Notes app on your phone or a notebook, writing about what it is that you've read is going to help you to dissect your reading and to gain a better understanding of it. Writing about your Bible study is also going to help you to remember what it is that you read. Alright, so this was way longer than I planned, but I hope that you found my four Bible study tips for beginners helpful. If you have any tips for Bible study, be sure to leave a comment down below. And finally, here's a bonus tip. Pray to God after study. The Bible is a call to action, so everything that you read is God telling you something. So when you talk to him after, ask him to help you better understand the text and learn what he wants you to do as a result. Well guys, thanks for watching and don't forget to come back for more tomorrow. Bye!